Logan Allen is going to get the start this afternoon for the Guardians. He'll be making start number four. This will be his first start against the Yankees and the last team he's pitched against in that American League East. Let's see how he fares against them today. He's going to need that command control and keep the walks down. Oh, right back against Allen. Comes up with it. It's going to be a little bit late. We'll see if Logan Allen is all right. Man, that thing came back in a hurry, right back up the middle. Got him on the Ooh. elbow. Oh, my goodness. You know, he, he took one in his second start in Seattle, but it was, he was fine. He got leather on it. This one did not catch any leather. And boy, that's going to have to, that is going to hurt. It sounded like he Eventually. absorbed the entire blow. It did, yes. It was right around the elbow. Hopefully it didn't get it on him because he's showing no pain, but I'm sure they'll have to keep an eye on that. He says he's okay. Right field, right at him. Loriano makes the catch. One down. Swing and a miss. He struck him out with a little cut fastball. And there are two down in the first. And that would have been a strike anyway if he didn't swing. There you the go. Air, center field. All right. Freeman. Settle down. Makes the catch. A scoreless first for Logan Allen. The Guardians are coming to bat. There's Nestor Cortez coming off a best outing he's had in a long time. Three starts, the 3.50 ERA. A looping fly ball into right field. Easy out for Soto. Gets in on his hands. Ground ball to Cabrera. Little low throw, and Anthony Rizzo cannot come up with it. That looked like it hit him in the palm. I don't know if that hit the dirt. You see Cabrera it takes a couple crow hops. That looked like it hit Anthony Rizzo right in the palm. A swing and a miss wave by Jose Ramirez. And the first strikeout of the afternoon for Nestor. Well, that's an outstanding changeup. Look how it goes down and away from Ramirez. Swing and a miss. Another strikeout for Nestor, able to work a clean first inning. We'll take this one to the second. Four seamer by you. Three consecutive strikeouts for the Yankee left hander. Fly ball left field. Verdugo underneath it. Two down. Yeah, it looks like he's starting to settle in a little bit. The, the fastball command's getting a little bit better. A little hesitation from Nestor. What was that little show of the baseball? <laughs> he faked through the ball. <laughs> <laughs> he watches it. I thought he was going to step off and lose his balance. Yeah, he steps. He didn't touch the ground yet. Oh, there he goes. I don't know if I've ever seen I've that. I've never seen it. And he finishes him up with a soft roller to Rizzo. Can't come up with it. Got to believe that's going to be the second error for Anthony Rizzo. The only thing that I'm thinking, it may go down, it may go down in the air, but I don't think you watch Cortez falls off to the third base side. I don't know if he gets over there in time to eat even get him in his swing and a miss that is the fourth strikeout for Nestor Cortez off to a strong start and that's ball four to Volpe will be on base again and an infield hit with his line drive off of Allen in the first a one out walk in the third line drive to right field Volpe had to freeze for a second but he's going to be on his way to third as Juan Soto will hold with a base hit first and third one down this is a line shot it's such a great swing and that'll bring up Aaron Judge Aaron Judge hasn't gotten hot at all and the Yankees still are 12 and 3 swung on hit high hit deep to left field way out of here and almost three quarters of the way up the bleachers and left a Majestic blast by Aaron Judge, and it's 3 nothing New York here in the third. 260th career home run for Aaron Judge. Jose Ramirez, the batter, swinging it right-handed. Struck out his first time up. Cleveland needs something to get going. There you go. He just there did. you go. Deep left field, up on the porch it goes. There you go. He made him get it up that time. That's how you end a slump with a two-out Two run homer for making a one run game. That's what they needed right there. After that three run homer, here comes Jose. He's got an answer for you. And he creases one down the right field line. Fair yes. ball headed for the corner. Josh on his way to second. And he'll pull in with a two out double. And that's got the joint jumping here on a Sunday afternoon. Naylor with a big lead. He's going to third to throw over, and he's gone. But the Guardians answer back a two run shot from Jose Ramirez and they are right back in it. Trevino bounced a second first time up. Drive to left center field and hit well and that's gone a solo shot for Jose Trevino his first of the year now four to two Yankees. You now the bottom of the lineup heating up you love to see that you get one of those two runs back that you gave up in the bottom of the, of the third inning. 
Soto lays down a bunt, perfectly executed. As Ramirez was playing back, giving him that infield bunt. The 2 1 offering. Right field and a rocket. Loriano re leaps up and makes the catch. That was a, like a frozen rope, I'll call it. Mm -hmm. Because it just stayed, it held its course. Throw it out of second base. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? That was an unbelievable play by Andres Jimenez. I don't know how he picked it, let alone <laughs> the presence of mind to tag the runner. Gabriel Arias leads off for Cleveland here, bottom of the fifth. He singled and scored in the third. In the air. Right center field. This one is long gone. First home run of the year for Gabriel Arias, and the Guardians are back within a run at four to three. That right. is right into his swing plane. Well, and he was patient enough, he got it. That's only the second hit he's allowed to a hitter, third time through the order. And I got him. him. Got him on the hand. Yes, it did. Oh, you'll take that. Hit batter. Now here's Josh Naylor. Rips it up the middle into center field. That'll tie the game. Quad scores. Freeman into third. He'll stop there. Josh Naylor delivers yet again. Slowed it down and popped him up. Nice job of pitching right there by Hunter Gaddis. One down. Again, his ability to speed him up and slow it down is getting some uh, weak contact. Struck him out to end the inning and solid relief work by Hunter Gaddis. I'm Weaver here. Here's a guy that I don't want to beat. 3 2. You're hitting something away. Swing and a miss. Good changeup from Weaver. That is a big out to start the eighth inning. Drop and drive, as you see right there. Cutter at 91 and two quick outs, back to back strikeouts here in the eighth inning for Weaver. Floreal now into the game. Lefty hitter. Three for 20, the former Yankees top prospect, hit out his first home run with his new team yesterday. In the air, deep right field. Soto will wave goodbye. How about that? A right fist raised in the air, and now a hop and a skip by Florio, circling the bases. And what a joyous jaunt it was for Esteban Florio against the club that traded him away. A pinch hit, solo home run to right. And now we go to the ninth. Emmanuel Classe will try to close it for the Guardians. Cabrera on at first on a fielder's choice. Now there are two men down in the ninth, and here's Anthony Volpe. Hard hit to right field. Brennan not able to come up with it. It goes all the way to the wall. Cabrera around third and coming home. And we're all tied up. Anthony Volpe comes through big time. 1-1 one, one to Stanton. Tapper down the third base line. Ramirez not going to have a play. An infield hit for John Carlos Stanton, and the bases are loaded with nobody out here in the tenth. Hot shot down the line. Base hit for Rizzo. Soto scores. Here comes Judge. Yankees lead 7 5. Boy, Anthony Rizzo has had a tough afternoon until that swing of the bat. What a big one. The first fries coming home with the throw. They got him. What a play. Throw to first. And that's going to end the inning. Phenomenal job defensively by the Guardians. There's a line drive center field base hit. Bo Naylor will stop at third. And now the winning run is coming to the plate. And there's a ground ball. Nice play by Torres. They get the out at second. A oh run boy. scores. And Josh Naylor, the tying run down at first base. Fry sends a high fly ball. Deep left center field. Judges back on the track at the wall. It's off the top of the fence. Josh Naylor racing around third. He's coming home. Now he stops. Oh, my goodness. David Fry almost tied the game. To the second baseman, Torres. He can't find the handle. He's thrown to the plate. Not in time. Naylor never slid, but somehow avoided the tag. And it's a tie game at seven. Andre Jimenez 0 for 4. Driven to right field. Plenty deep enough. Here comes Fry with the game winner, and the Guardians walk it off. And another.